All right, greetings YouTube. Um, today I'm gonna to show you my uh, rebuilt Hoover wind tunnel self propel, whatever model it is. Um, I did a YouTube video of this machine doing a rebuild, but since last week, um, I deleted the video up off of YouTube because it took so long to re like for it to upload, and so um, I was gonna do a video of it. Um, <clears throat> of it running, I'm gonna do a test run with this machine. Um, why do why I say rebuild means I uh, <coughs> change some parts on here and add <coughs> something on here that something was not on here before. Uh, I took. I'm gonna show you what I done. I replaced the upper hose one holder from a Hoover Self Propel Anniversary U six four eighty five. 100 uh i put a different cable i took the cable from the u6425 um i parted it out because it got too loud so and the motor that's over in the corner i'm gonna break that apart i'm just gonna scrap it uh and then i add a dirt finder to this machine and the model number is u6425900 now i just need an ultra door panel for this um I don't know when I'm going to be able to get it, but I changed some belt. I put new belts in, and at this point, it's not self-propelling, so I just need, you know, need a new, uh, need a new cable, and actually, I need another V-belt. Well, I changed the belts on there. The V-belt, oh, no, I, oh, I have this, it's hung, I believe I have this hung. Um, it just ended up making the, bro uh, yeah, this V belt right here is what I put on here, causing the new, the new flat belt to keep popping off the vacuum, which is shit, excuse me for my language, but it just kept popping off the new, uh, flat belt and which it made it burn. So I'm like, man, I said, okay, well. I said it's gotta be a, the the uh, that V belt and the V belt I put on here is split, but it's still in contact so of the brush roll spinning. So I put a new bag in. You know I wiped the uh, inside of it out. You know put a new bag in. While I service it, put a new bag in. Put a uh, scent tablet in to make the vacuum smell good. You got your attachments. You got your telescopic ones. You have your uh. Attachments here first and all Incredibly cool. Need a new dust and brush. Well, this dust and brush came off of a nest cell propeller. It's worn. So, uh, yeah. Vacuum runs okay. So, uh, after I rebuild it, um, and as you can tell, I don't know if you can see it. Last time I serviced this was last year. In uh, in September, actually, that's because I watched the dark one. And as you can tell, I put this label right there, a sticker, while I rebuild it. So it's been rebuilt. Um, so the vacuum is ready to be. So it feels really hard to uh, use. I don't got a uh, helper filter in, but it's okay. Um, Transmission everything is okay. Brush roll is okay. Alright. 